Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this video is about your doc or your document palette. Whenever I cleared mine out just for this video, whenever you make a new color or a new object and fill that color in, it puts it in your document palette. But what if you want to make a specialized color? Let's hold down the control button and add a little blue to this green. Then I can just take it and drag it till you get that plus sign. And now you've got a new color in your color palette. So then all you have to do is go and you've got that color in your color palette. I much prefer doing that than having it over here because it would get kind of confusing because this is a totally new palette. So if we, if we just add a color, any color we put in the palette, we've got it there. And let's do that again. Hold down the control and add a little white, make it a really light purple. Grab the pick tool and put it in there. Now, what if you want to delete that color? Hit this arrow right here. It's kind of tricky because you've got to hit the arrow because it's trying to create a new arrow right there. Delete a color. So I deleted that color. Now, if you want to delete all the colors, kind of weird because you got to do that delete edit colors and you've got this color right here and I've taken away when it question is what you want to do delete color it goes to the next color delete color delete color delete color now you've got a clear color palette so when you start a new new uh, job and you make some items and you turn that one into blue it puts it in your color palette now if you don't want that color palette visible you can just go to tools you know go to windows color palettes and turn off the document palettes and then that way if you're working you don't want it there and then you go well i might want to use that and especially i just made a new color and i Put a little red in it, I hold down the control button, make it a little bit different. And I want to drag that into it, just go to Windows, Color Palettes, turn, turn on your document palettes. And then there's that new color that we can add to. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.